let's get your Clover system ready to fire orders. Your printer comes with paper and a five foot power cable. And here's what else you'll need. A power outlet, an internet source, either your modem or router with an available ethernet connection, and a Cat5 ethernet cable long enough to reach. Your order printer must be connected to the same router as your Clover devices. First, connect your ethernet cable to the order printer and the other end to your router or modem. Insert your paper roll. Now, plug the power cable into the bottom of your printer and into your power source. And flip the switch on the side of the printer to on. The red and yellow lights should slowly blink. When you see a single green light turn on, your order printer is communicating with your network. Next, we'll add the printer to each Clover device you want to print orders from. On your Clover device, open the Printers app and tap the green plus button. Then select the order printer you just connected. To confirm that the printer is set up, print a test receipt. You want to follow these steps for each Clover device. To edit the name of a printer in the Printers app, tap Edit. Enter the new name, then tap Save. Now, we'll assign a label to the items you want to automatically send to the printer. First, select Inventory, then Labels, and tap the plus icon to add a new label. Consider using the printer name for the name of the label. You can add this label to existing menu items. Just tap the pencil icon and select each item you want to label, then Save. Last, we'll assign the label to your printer. Open the Printers app and choose the order printer you want to assign the label to. Next, select the labels you're assigning to the printer and save. And now you're ready to fire orders. To learn more about setting up, go to clover.com help.